The whole time on my way home, I was praying, surely not, Lord, this can't be. Not married, this, there's no way I can be pregnant. Get home with four tests, all positive. Then I start thinking out of sheer fear, everything you can possibly imagine, good, bad, and indifferent. And that was the very first thing. I'm four, I just turned 40, so I was 39, not married, and now I have to tell my parents that I'm pregnant? It's like, there's no way. What are they gonna think of me? And to know that I had to stand and tell the church that, oh, by the way, your youth pastor is pregnant and not married. That's all I could think of was rejection. People turning their back on me. Um, I start Googling abortion clinics because I thought my life was officially over. Everything that I've worked so hard for is over. I couldn't see past, I couldn't see past the fear. And I Google abortion and Wiregrass Hope pops up. I was like, what is this? So I start researching and I call the number. And I come in, I take the test and it's positive. And she said, we need to do an ultrasound. And I see, the baby on the ultrasound and it was nothing joyous I was even more consumed with fear at that point and she hands me the ultrasound I said I don't want it I want nothing to do with this ultrasound I walk out more confused I go into even more research on everything like I, I can't do this um, I go as far as going into an abortion clinic. And I was like, God. And my prayer was, give me the strength to get out of here. Give me the courage to get up and get out. And that moment, they called my name and I went back there. Then I asked one question and she looks at me, she said, are you ready to do this? I said, I don't think so. She looks at me and she said, if you're not ready to do this, get up and walk out now. Turned around and walked out and said, take me home, I'm gonna be a mom. Immediately the very next day, I called Wiregrass Hope and said, I need to come in. I need to talk to somebody. Can I please do another ultrasound? I come in and Miss Jeannie did my ultrasound and she just hugged my neck. We repeated the ultrasound. I wanted to know what her heartbeat was. She turned up the volume and said, we're gonna let you really hear this heartbeat. So I heard the heartbeat and she printed out the ultrasound and she handed it to me. I took it and then I looked at her and said, Miss Jeannie, can I have my first ultrasound? She said, absolutely. So then I was able to get the one thing I was ready to throw away back. I can't imagine where I would be if I would have chose the abortion. I can't imagine. If I'd have, I'd have missed the greatest thing of my life. I would have missed my daughter. If I would have never called Wiregrass Hope, I'd have never had hope. I probably would have done the one thing I can't imagine doing. Wiregrass Hope is a perfect name. They offer hope when there is no hope. They are a rock when you have no rock to stand on. Your, they help you find your voice when you have no voice. They pray for you when you can't even pray for yourself. They love you when you can't even love yourself. I would recommend Wiregrass Hope to anybody. Choose life. It's worth it.